I turned around. Hey, gone. I'm good. How are you? I'm so oh, good, thank you. Wow. What's your name? Where are you from? My name's Liam Keats Riley. I'm 19 and I'm from Brisbane. I was definitely a very extroverted kid. You'd see me running around in circles a lot. This 13 year old, six foot kid, and my mum's like, hey, basketball doesn't start till term three. You should study music after school. And then I also fell in love with singing and performing for people and just love it now. The adrenaline's gonna be pumping, man. It's gonna... It already is. I know, right? I can tell, like, going on stage, I'll be shaking out of excitement because I just want to go bang, 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 bang. But, like, I have to, like, harness that energy and just kind of use it where it counts. That's what's gonna do me good. Be <laughs> spot. <laughs> the song I'm singing tonight was actually in the movie The Sapphires, and Jessica Malboy was in the movie The Sapphires, so the pressure's on to just to try and get it right. If you make a mistake in this song, Jess is going to know it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to come right out and say it. You were, you were great. I loved everything. My team is almost full to the brim and I couldn't turn. And I did not expect to spin around and see... I love that. ...somebody <laughs> from Five Seconds of Summer standing right there. It's just, <laughs> just like... With that voice. Incredible. How did you get into that kind of music? So um, I study uh, jazz at, at uni, so that's like something that I'm really into. Why didn't you do a jazz song? If, is jazz your first love? I love jazz because I feel it's just such a good gateway into all of these other genres. So you've got like rock, R&B, soul, funk. Right. Like all of that kind of stuff stems from jazz. So if you can understand that, you can kind of play and sing whatever you want. You need to get yourself to New Orleans then. Yeah, And man. stay there for a couple of weeks. Yeah. First of all, what an audition that was, wasn't that? And I saw when we turned around a little, because always we can see if somebody sort of like, the adrenaline hits and you get kind of like, eh. um, but you know what, you kept your cool. You did, you kept your cool, you didn't get distracted and you finished the job and you did a really, really good job. Really good. So I think you have a really solid um, confident streak that you already have in place that now you just need a great mentor to really keep you in that lane because I don't think there's anybody else in this competition that we've seen so far mm. that has that lane. I think that me and you together would work so well and, you know, I'd love to get to know you a bit more and really find some songs that suit your tone, suit your personality, you know, so I would love to work with you. Yeah. Come to three times. Back up, back up. <laughs> <laughs> If anybody remembers, I was in a film <laughs> called The Sapphires, and, <laughs> and you know, when you, when you sung the Wilson Pickett version, um, it just really took me back to, you know, being a part of that film and actually being introduced uh, to all that music at the time, having to also learn the moves. I don't know, do you know the moves of that? Uh, not particular. I know, like, I know some of them. Like, obviously, you got, you got the mashed potato, the Y2C. I can teach you those moves, and we can oh. stay in that world. 
you know? Boys, if you, you if know? you're yeah. offering to come out, you yeah. You know what I mean? Right. You know, you got to know how to pony. Oh. Say, or pony marone. Oh. Si, si, mashed potato. Oh. To the alligator. Yeah. Now put your hands on the inside and let your backbone slip. Hey. Is she still pitching? Na, 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 You know what I mean? I love it. I love it, man. we can do this. You and I can do this. We can have fun. We could have fun like that. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're amazing. Thank I'm, you so I'm, much. I'm so, I'm so excited for you. Thank you so much. You know, <laughs> I'm done with you. <laughs> well, I would have done that in mentoring. Still could. Still and could. I still well. can. I'm just going to have to, like, shamelessly try. Here, here, I hereby declare that you should be on my team. Right now! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Liam, you've had two of the most sassiest pitches I think I've seen in a long, yeah. long time. I did say pitches, pitches by the way. Pitches, pitches, yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> can't take us anywhere. God bless closed captioning. You have let's, to choose. Yeah, let's yeah. get down. Let's. I think that it's a really hard decision to make with two like amazing coaches. But I think I think for today I'm gonna have to go with Rita. Rita! Oh my goodness. Good effort, though. Good effort. Again, we, never... we did good. Look, she's out. A for she's effort. out cold. You, she's you out. killed the coach. I'm sorry, Jess. <laughs> no, you know what? She's the bomb, man. Oh. Diggity, and I'm so excited for you. Yes. You guys are gonna have a good Such time. Such a good time. We're gonna, we're gonna go right into that soul. Bye let's bye. go. Thank let's you. go. Dude, awesome job, man. Really good. <laughs> I'm gonna snap the heel for him. See, I'm not. <laughs> That's some good moves, Jessica, my boy. Seriously, I, I almost forgot him. I was like, oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. You are Tusi Lucy. Come oh. on. <laughs> Hi, Mom. <laughs> oh, yay. He's a star. He's a, he really are. You sounded awesome. Yes, you sounded didn't he? so good. So good. Thank you so well much. Well done. Go and celebrate. Relax. Only for a bit. Only for a bit. <laughs> Bye. She puts out the Rita aura. That's the right. That's the, that's the thing. That's the thing. And it's like a moth to a flame. Snatch, baby. Man, Snatch. what a sassy pitch. Snatch, baby. Snatch. <laughs> Snatch. The pressure is on in the callbacks, and Team Rita still has three spots to fill. Performers Liam and Georgie went head to head. I am no Iggy Iggy Azalea. People see who mom's got you and see. Whoa! Dancing in the alley with a long tall Sally. Liam came out on top and earned a spot in the battles. Do I believe that if I throw something at him, he can smash it and deliver? Yes, I do. I think he'll set the stage on fire. For my next battle, I have my cool, edgy baby, Xanthi, and my lovable bear, Liam. Blind auditions, I sung Led of a Thousand Dancers by Wilson Pickett. So I just can't wait to get back on the stage and sing again. What an audition that was, wasn't that? Na, 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 na. I don't relate to you. I don't what? relate to you, no. Cause I never... For my blind audition, I sang Happier Than Ever by Billie Eilish. You made me it felt really good to see that, oh, they actually turned for me. You're a great, great storyteller, and I just can't wait to see what happens with you. I am excited. I have challenged them to sing Don't Speak by No Doubt, which is a classic. I didn't know the song at all. That does add a bit of anxiety. 
There's advantages to not knowing a song. You can see it with fresh eyes and you can give it your own interpretation. This version is very different. It's actually moodier, it's more haunting, and it's full of desperation. I really wanted to tap into whatever they need to tap into to deliver this. I'm really confident in what I have to offer. Hopefully Rita can see that because I definitely think I'm far from finished here. Expect a fight from me. I'm gonna push myself to the limit. I'm gonna bring my absolute best. I'm going to win this battle. of that song. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Keith, who do you think won the battle? Rita. <laughs> it was, uh, I love that version. It was such a great take on that song. Yeah. What I love too is that the song didn't favour either of you, in my opinion. I thought you were able to both be yourself in that song. But I think from a sort of like owning the stage and feeling more like an absolute pro, I think Xanthi had it. Thank you, Keith. Thank you. I agree with Keith. I think Xanthi embodied the, the arrangement a little bit more, but I think Liam, it, it sat better in your range. So I think vocally it probably let you shine a little bit more. Thanks, Dad. Thank Rita, it's time. Who was the winner of this battle? First of all, you should be so proud of that performance. <laughs> Liam, you, for me, have really great understanding of your own vocal ability. Like, you can really know what you're, you're, you're good at. Like, your runs were really clean. And Xanthi, your stage presence is so powerful. You both were outstanding. But I can only pick one. So the winner of this battle is... Xanthi. Congratulations, Nancy. Thank you, Rita. I can promise you, you will not regret this. This will be great. This will be great. I'm so excited. Yes, thank you for thank giving me this. Oh, thank you, really. 
Unfortunately, Liam, that does mean that your time on The Voice here has come to an end. Uh, I just want to say thank you, Rita, for taking me on this journey. It's been amazing. It's something that I'll never forget. So thank, thank you so you. much for that opportunity. Thank you. Thank you for being it. Big round of applause yeah. from the room. Thank you, Liam. You did great. Thank well you, Liam. Well done, Liam.